Hey everyone, welcome back to Howtex. We're gonna do another benchmark today. We have 3D Marks Slingshot Extreme. We're gonna put it on an iPhone XS Max. Hot off the presses, just came out a couple days ago. And here on the left we have an iPhone 7 Plus. Good old iPhone 7 Plus. Okay, so let's try to run these at approximately the same time. Okay, three, ready? Three, two, one, go. Okay, here we are, finally done. So let's take a look at the results. So no surprise here, the uh, brand new one, of course, much faster. Um, but uh, the iPhone 7 actually can kind of kept up, uh, especially till the snow part. It was only, you know, a few seconds back. So uh, looking at the score, not too bad. Uh, we have 3,500. I think that's probably the highest we've ever got on any of these tests with any phone. Um, kind of hard to compare Android phones and uh, Apple ones, but basically 3500 versus 1950 on the iPhone 7 Plus here. So uh, let's take a look at some of the results from what we can see. So uh, frames rate, we have 24 frames per second versus 18 on test 1, test 2, 12 versus nine, so it's you know 33, 30% faster on the frame rates, give or take. Uh, physics, graphics score, way, way higher. Physics score, way, way higher. As expected, there's basically nothing that this thing can possibly outscore this guy on, because it's just an A12 versus an A10, a 2018 versus a 2016. So no surprises here. So that's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Give us a thumbs up and check out some of our other benchmarks with many, many other Apple and Android phones using 3D Marks and Shot Experience. Okay, that's it for today. Check out Howtex. Okay, so that's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Check out some of our other Slingshot Extreme benchmark tests with this phone and a lot of other ones. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye have an iPhone 10s Max. I'm going to show you how to insert and remove SIM cards. As you can see, we have two SIM cards and this is the Hong Kong edition of the phone.